Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel Leela Web Dev. In this video, we will see how to write the fixable code that we have written for our custom rules. We have written our custom rules and if you try to run this npm run lint, we are able to see the errors that we are able to see some sort of errors. Now, those errors we need to manually edit, uh, we, we need to manually solve those errors. Now ESLint for example if you see some kind of error something like uh, these all are expected expect line breaks these all things is there right here you are able to see that 12 errors can be fixed with the hyphen hyphen fix so that means we can write something like npm run lint hyphen fix so that automatically the ESLint will fix these, uh, these errors which could be resolvable how this how the ESLint is fixing these errors that means the rules whatever the rules they are having so here you will be able to see that all the rule all the errors has been gone and we are able to see only the four errors that means these four errors are written by us only by us means that those are our custom rules only now we have we are showing the custom rules error but we are not fixing it we are telling the user to fix it manually now if some errors which could be fixed by the ESNet automatically means it would be better right how we can we implement those type of fixable error fixable code now if you try to see here if you try to see this get payments okay here we are having this get payments and now I am I am enabling this get latest payments and if you try to see if you try to enable this get payments thing we are throwing an error that don't use this get payments please use the get latest payments we have uh, we have written a custom rule for that one let's try to run this npm run lint then you will, you will be able to see that error now if you try to see why my system is slow I don't know so prettier itself uh, the format itself is running very slow see again it is coming saving repeat here i don't know why it is coming so it is going away now you are here you will be able to see that get payments is deprecated use get latest payments that means we have written a custom rule that in the find payments.js that if, if anybody calling with get payments means please we are asking us to replace it with the get latest payments now it is better for us if you fix it automatically now we know that get payments need to be replicate uh, need to be replaced with the get latest payments method it is better for us to replace it directly with the ESLint code. So now when the user wants to run something like npm run lint if and fix means now the uh, automatically if the code fixes it means it is better right. How can we fix that one? So how we can write that fixable code here? If you go to the ESLint documentation, if you go to the for example developer guide and here working with the rules. If I go to working with the rules in this one you will be able to see you come down down somewhere down you will be able to see another option yeah here applying fixes if you would like to ESLint to attempt to fix the problem you are reporting that means the whatever the problem you are reporting through the ESLint if you want to fix that problem means you need to write a method fix property you need to create a fix property that fix property is a method which which has the fixer object okay now let's try to implement this fix one now if you go to the find payments here you will be able to see the context report if you want to fix this one means you need to write fix and here this property will be a function and here you will be having a fixer okay now fix function fixer you are having like this now what is the thing they are saying you are here you need to return fixer dot insert text after so that means it is inserting the text after the node but we don't want to insert the text we, we want to replace the text if you try to see here we want to replace this whole text right now what we will try to see let's try to see is there any other methods so here if you are if you are try to see the fixer object has the following methods here let's try to see the fixer methods if you try to see here the fixer methods this is the method which could be easily uh, that is useful for us replace text we need to replace the text we need to pass the node or token and the text that uh, replaceable text what is the text we now we want to replace now here i can return fixer dot replace right? replace text not test text and we need to pass the node they are saying you need to pass the node and the text so here i can write something like get latest payments okay i can use this one directly so now if i try to run npm run lint again let's try to run npm run lint so i am running the npm run lint let's try to see whether we are able to so whether we are getting this error or not if i try to run it <coughs> let's see yeah here we are able to see that 
get payments is deprecated use get latest payments and here down also the error also has been changed that one error can be fixable with the hyphen hyphen fix option it is saying that means this error can be fixable previously we are not able to get that error now when we write the fix method it is telling that one error can be fixable with the fix option okay fine let's try to do it npm run lint hyphen fix whether it will fix or not let's try to see and here also in the get payments also we will see here get payments this method is will be replace it with the get latest payments or not if you try to run it let's see whether it will try it is trying to execute that fix method or not i don't know why my system is very slow We're running lint also it is taking so much of time if i press enter okay if i press enter it coming now we are not able to get, we are not getting this get payments deprecated error now if you try to see here okay the text is replaced but here if you try to see the brackets didn't came so the method calling didn't came so that means the code what we have written is having some error if you try to see here node node means it represents the entire node here if you go to the find payment sorry in the get payments it is re node means nothing but it replaces with the entire thing so like this the entire thing if you try to see sorry get payments so node means it replaces with the entire thing so including the brackets everything it is replaced now i don't want this one to replace with entire thing i want to replace with the only callee only callee is also a node only node dot callee i will employ i will employ node dot callee let's see whether it could be implemented whether it could be solved or not now if i try to run lint again so now we need to get an error that one we'll try to see we got an error that get payments is deprecated use get latest payments yeah we got it now let's try to fix it npm run lint hyphen fix i am fixing this one let's see how we can fix if i use npm run lint fix let's see whether this get payments will be replaced with the get latest payments or not see automatically it is replaced get latest payments now here execution so now we are not we are not seeing any error this is how we will be writing the fixable code for our custom rules now we have seen how to write the custom rule and also we have seen how to fix the uh, fix the uh, fix the error that has been that that the problem that you are reporting through the eslint so we have seen entire the custom rules hope you understood about this one so the entire code i am posting i am i am uh, pushing it in the github repository you can see in my github repository so all my source code videos uh, whatever the videos i am doing everything will be there here you'll be able to see here in the eslint hyphen course in the eslint hyphen setup you will be able to see all the code what i have what, what i am doing up to now you can be able to find it here automatically okay hope you understood about this how to fix this custom rules next video we will come with a new topic again about the plugins eslint plugin and the eslint config what is this eslint plugin and eslint config if you want to use third party means how can how we can use let's try to see it in the next video if you have any doubts or any suggestions please post the comments below to this video and if you like this video please do support me by subscribing to my channel thank you